My name is Millicent Okoye. And this is my story. <laughs> Are you telling me this guy still comes after you? Ha! Oh, what, every day. Every day. Every day that guy has his name. But I I don't feel like settling down now. That's the issue. I really don't want to settle down no, now. No, 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 no. No sense. No. The question here should be, do you feel anything for that guy? It's not about whether you feel like suddenly that. Do you feel anything for him? No, I will never lie to you. Exactly. I don't feel anything for him. In fact, I don't even think he's ready to settle down. Ha -ha. He doesn't have money. He doesn't look like someone that has any tangible thing to offer a woman. You know? And then most times when he comes, he's always jumping bike or take care, no car. Uh -uh, for someone that wants to settle down, hey, Mbani. Really, my friend. He doesn't come across as serious. Look at you. Really, you're working and you're making money for yourself. What, what, what are you going to be using the money you're making to do? This is why the Bible calls it a helpmeet. You have to support a man. It's not all the time that people find, that women find already made, you know. Hey, I understand what you're saying. Yeah. Hey, but at least. I will enjoy his money small. Hey, hey, when I am not helping him, I will know that he's not using me. You want to the thing? Uh uh. No, now. That is not silly. how it is done. You know, only that's the thing. See, you. You are see, open your eyes. You're not seeing what I'm seeing in that guy, Millie. I'm telling you that you're not seeing what I'm seeing. If you're seeing what I'm seeing, you should better consider that guy. Better reason his proposal alone. I know why I'm telling you this. Okay. okay. Think about it. Better think fast. It's not my heart. Well, I'm not very excited. I'm not to you. <laughs> Hi, Millicent. How are you, baby? Come on, don't that face. How are you? What is it? <sighs> Nothing bad. Please, can we sit somewhere and talk? I really want to talk to you, please. I can't sit and talk with you. And what are you doing here? Are you stalking me now? No, no, no. God forbid. Why, why would I do that? I wasn't stalking you. I was on my way to your house when I saw you walking. I followed you up. <laughs> and that is stalking. Anyway, like I said, I don't have time to sit and talk with you. I have things to do. Millicent, please. I need to talk to you. Please. Just give me a minute. I heard you the first time and I am saying it again. I do not have that time to sit and talk. Please. I love you, Millicent. I love you so much and I will keep coming to you until you accept my proposal. I do love you. Can't you see? Please. Millicent. Millicent. I'm a little bit I'm a little bit I guess you know the reason I invited you over to my house. It is in regards of my son's proposal to you. I want to know the reason you have been turning him down. Is it that he is not your kind of man? Or oh, because... Uh, he is not financially balanced like your family. What is the problem? It doesn't have anything to do with his financial status. Kedi not at all. Kedi Forbes, what is it? Um, nothing serious. So, just that I don't want to get married yet. <laughs> Only that, Sosia. Hey, I was thinking there was something serious. Maybe now my son, one thing or the other, that was the reason you are turning him down. Eh? You are still of age. 
Are you telling me that you're too young to get married? Of course, I know that's not the issue here. Eh? You are at the point. Now, let me tell you. Do you know how many young girls, older than you, about your age, all of them, going to different churches in search of husbands? Yes. But here you are, my daughter. My son has been crying for you. Morning, afternoon, night is, is your name that is on his mouth. Cross my own mouth because I also call your name. Because we love you. And then, please, eh? if my son has not pleaded very well, let me add my own because I want to marry you. Amma, 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 I don't know, please promise me that you are going to talk to my son positively. Because if you do, I'll be very happy. I'll talk to you. Is it a promise? Are you promising me that you talk to my son? I'll talk to you. Not just talking to him. Just are you telling me that when you talk to him, you talk to him positively, as in saying yes. <laughs> when you smile, this this is the way I stretch my neck to see your face. <laughs> when you smile, my heart beats like <laughs> with this. Girl, be my daughter in law. <laughs> eh? Me? I'll talk to you. You promise me. Oh, my little. <laughs> hey! hey! Nemo! You know what? Hey! Preparing for a marriage is not easy at all. <laughs> eh? Even though uh, uh, Millicent's family was the one that did the major work. But the little we did, eh? It was not just easy, so exhausting. <laughs> Traditional marriage is always stressful. Just take it like that. Mm -hmm. It's right, always man. stressful. You're, right. yeah. You're correct. Only if it was white wedding. Mama, would have just employed the services of event planners. Sit and wait for the big day. Yes, um, <laughs> thank you very much, everyone. Thank you so so much for making this process a progress. I really appreciate. Mama, um, thank you. My dear sister, thank you so much. But most especially, I want to thank this beautiful woman here, Millicent. Oh, God. Thank God that I found you for accepting <laughs> to marry me. <laughs> Mama, she has made me a complete man. My joy is full. Hey! <laughs> so where do I come into this one? So people has never ever in their life said thank you. For the nine good moons that I carry them in my womb, nurture them through childhood to adulthood and made them become who they are today. They have never said thank you. Mama! <laughs> okay, okay, no problem. Thank you, Mama, for bringing us to this world. We really appreciate it. God bless you. Keep it your hands on. Keep it your hands on. Come let me manage it now. Uh -huh. Thank you. So Thank God much. that Millicent came because if she hadn't been here or accepted to marry me, Marry you, you won't remember to thank me. <laughs> thank, thank, thank God you are here. Move. Hey, listen. Come on, move. Listen. Go. What are you doing? Hey, hey. hey. Listen. Please, I am begging you. What did I do? Shut up. Why do you want to kill me? You have to die for me to be rich. I'm tired of you, witch. Hey, listen, I am your wife. You cannot do this to me. You are witch, you are not my wife. You have to die no, for no, me to no, be rich. No, no, no. Why do you want to kill me? Why do you? Why do you? Baby, what is it? What happened? You want to kill me? Ah. Me you want, want to kill me? Me want to kill you? Why do you want to kill me? Why do you want to kill me? My love, how can I kill you, my wife? Okay, baby, baby, calm down, calm down. Go back to sleep. It's just a dream, okay? It's just a dream. Go back to sleep, okay? It's just a dream.
anything wrong in anything you do. Finish it. Finish it. You will not see anything wrong. You don't want me to eat, eh? Fine. I'm going inside. This man. This is the second time he's doing this. Second time he's walking out of the house without eating. Want to kill me? Hi. Hmm. This is the third time I'm having this same dream in a month. What is heaven trying to tell me? Did I make a mistake? So I married the wrong guy. Is my life in danger? What is going on? Hi! This is becoming serious. This is becoming very serious. <laughs> I don't know what you did to what did you do to me? I just called me. Go. Sorry. Everybody, <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> it's nothing. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sweet mm. girl and holistic and uh, mm. I hope you're fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm fine. Nsiro, why are you disturbing us? Eh? Nsiro, don't you sleep? Please rest. Uh -uh. Which? The fuck? Take. Ah. What was that? Enno, baby. Enno, this is She's trying to spell my name. And I want to sleep now. Analytic, I know. Oh, 
eat too much. <laughs> So Vincent slept outside his house again. As in, it's been four days and Vincent hasn't been home. Hi! What did I do to myself? What did I do to myself? Eh? I didn't want to. In fact, I was not even ready for this marriage. If not that, his mother and his sisters begged and begged and put pressure on me. I won't be here. Now look at what I'm going through. My God, how did I make this kind of mistake? <laughs> Hello, Mama. Good morning, Ma. Mama, it's Vincent too. Eh? Mama, Vincent has changed. He has changed so much. Do you know, for the past four days, Vincent has been out of this house. He hasn't been home. He doesn't pick his calls. He doesn't call back, at least to give me a piece, a, a bit of a, a peace of mind. Let me know where he is. The last time I called him, a woman picked his phone and called me a witch. Mwah. That is what it looks like. I mean, why, why else would a woman pick his phone by that time of the night? And I want you. in a better manner than this. Shut up! Wake me up in a better manner? Which way? You're here spoiling my kitchen. Do you know how much it costs to put a set of kitchen in a living room? Do you know? Did the people send anybody with you to my house? Did you edit it? Oh, it's gone. Why? But I was only watching TV. And I slept off. TV? 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 Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Let the sickness stay inside. Hey! Go inside. Go Listen, why are you? Welcome. Welcome. Welcome, Bukwaya. Come on. Is that your sister? Hey, sir. What kind of woman is this one now? Huh? See. Millie, where are you? I'm still asking you. Where have you been for the past five days? And who was that woman that picked your phone and had the guts to call me a witch? Millicent! Millicent! What is it? What do you want? You have the effrontery to ask me such a silly question. What an impetus! What an audacity! Are you mad? Are you saying that I do not have the right to ask my husband where he has been for the past five days without picking his calls or even calling him? Ah! You must ah! be very stupid. You must! Chinike. Mimi? Mili Mili? Mili Mili? 
Mim? 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 Baby, no, no, I was just playing now. This is just this, is, this small push. Yeah? Mimi. Hey, Chino, I was Mimi, 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 Who is there? Me? Me? Hey, who's my phone? Um, baby, Isn't it obvious that I'm going out? Are you blind? Um, are you going to stay long? I mean, what, what time are you coming back? What kind of stupid question is that one? I don't know when I'm coming back. Any problem? Baby, please, now I can't stay alone. I, I, you remember what the doctor said? Millicent! Millicent! So, I should leave my office and come back home and play nanny for you, Ewa? Is that what you want? You must be out of your mind. Tell me, are you the first pregnant woman to ever exist? Or are you carrying message in that your stupid womb? Tell me. What is all this now? Why are you tormenting my life, Millicent? Eh? I should leave my office, come and sit at home and babysit you. Is that what you want? Now tell me, if I come out and sit at home and babysit you, how do I get money for our survivor? How do I feed you and that stupid thing in your womb? How? How do I get money? Millicent! Millicent! Be very careful! Let this be your first and last time you mention this silly thing to me again. I'm off to work. Witch. There's no problems. Okay? Please, I'm begging you. I need I need someone to be around me. Please, I, it hasn't been easy for me in my condition. Biko. Hmm. Really? Well, um well said and done. Um you move down to my mom's house, okay? I believe my sisters and my mom. They will take good care of you. Yes, very good. In the village? No, in the town. <laughs> Why can't we invite them over here? I mean, I'm going to be more comfortable in our own Maybe house. Sense. What are you saying? That my mom's house is uncomfortable for you? No, ah? no, 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 uh -huh. no. That's not what I said. Better? Um, so what are you saying? Oh, it's fine. I'll go. When you are ready, let me know. Huh? Did you hear me? Imagine that evil girl coming here to take refuge and she wants to be treated like a queen who cut her head. Can you imagine? Eh? Stress this. My doctor said that. Like I have never been pregnant before. Eh? Mama, the worst is ever since my elder brother got married to this witch, I don't know if things are moving from north to south for him. Is he north or south? Since she came into our brother's life, everything good has actually stopped in his life. Help! Help! Chimo! Help! Chine now what has my son got it for himself? Because eh? the worst is, I don't even know what kind of charm she used on my son. Eh? And worst of it is, 
Biko, is she not older than my son? Yeah, are you not older than my son? Hmm. Of course! She is older than him! Hmm. Eh? Let me look at her. Oh, yes, oh, it's true. Look at her very well. Eh? Are you thinking? She is older than my brother. Agadi Akwenka. Okukibo. Eh? Oprah no Diego. Let's say that she has money. That's why my brother married her. At least a Jew and Kara hold nobody. Money? Iji ho. Nkai Kara. Chia. Momoro. Not that her family even have a name. Her father has no name to say we are even running after their name so that we we'll say, I work. We are running after their name. Nothing like that. Meanwhile, what is she cooking? Are you cooking stone? Mm -hmm. eh? Is she cooking stone? Come on, Nene. Hey, Toto. Better check go. what she gives us for even to eat. Let me know what you think. Two kisses over one. Mama! Hey! You've been cooking hot water. I got your cuenca. Hey! Mama! I can't even smell anything. I'm not perceiving anything. Mama, meaning we had in our cook. Yeah, mama! I said it all. What? I can't smell. So we just put water on the fire. Where are you? I don't want it. You have you been cooking nothing. Pounding empty water. Hey! Miracle! For the past two hours. Hot water. Finally did it. You finally showed who you are, witch. So you finally killed my own grandchild out of your witchcraft. You did. How can you say a thing like that? It is my child we're talking about here. Shut up! Shut up! Look at you. So this is who you are. You have proven yourself right as a witch. Because if you are not, you would have opened your mouth to utter a word. You are talking. Eh? How did you do it? Tell me. How did you kill my child? I did not kill my child. You did? I'm also a limwa. A limwa. I'm also a limwa. I'm also a limwa. Tell me how you did it. Tell me how you did it. Oh, tell me how you did it. When you get me plastic plates, come with a million. Let me fetch water, this cup. 
Oninge. Give me plastic bowl. I was asking you to get me plastic bowl. Right. Mama, Vincent just called. He said your number is not reachable. Hmm. What did he say? He said he's good. he will be back by next week. Is he? That's okay. Hey, girl, get it. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, Come on, pull down your dress. Mama, hey! You needed to have seen what happened in church today. Mommy released marital prophecies to the single. Mm -hmm. hmm. <laughs> I hope you claimed for us. No, I claimed for myself. Obviously, you did not need prayers. Mama, can you imagine? One hour, one hour! Before Uncle. If we had needed prayers, we would have gone with her. You know what I mean? What are you doing at all? I beg you not to go to church. At least I answered the call and I passed the message. Go down hey! go for me. Eh? Wait, let me for you. Come on, Raghel. What the hell? What the hell? Please get me a plastic bowl, Hey! Mommy gave me a prophecy. Prophecy. About what? About Millicent. And um, what about her? She asked me to bring her to the church that she has a message for her. A message for her? Eh? Why? What are you waiting for? Take her now. Take her to the church. Uh, maybe. She has actually seen the evil we've been seeing in her too. And then, mm -hmm. that means I will take her there by next week. Ah, Vincent will also be coming by next week. That's, that's fine. Please, let me go and get something for myself. Oh, you, Jay. <laughs> Make sure you cook. Go. <coughs> what my family back? You went there to insult my family. You are a useless girl. You are a witch. Hey! I was even thinking you are a good girl. I never knew you were pretending. Idiot! You let I will tell my mother in fact. Let's get to the house. You will see what will happen to you. I am talking to you. Answer me. I say I am talking to you. Answer me. Wicked girl, you have a dark heart. Go punish you. Go will destroy you for causing my family. For causing us pain. So you want to cost us. You want us to be to be useless now. It is you! All your costs are to back to you. Back to Zeno! Millicent, you cost my family. You cost my family. It's okay. Now let me tell you something. There is nothing, absolutely nothing, that this your stupid cause will do to me or to my family. Again, let me tell you. You see this, my daughters? They will all get married and have their children. Amen. Much more children. Amen. More than you have ever wished to have in your life. Amen. Wicked witch. And I born evil blown away. Who are you to curse us? Who are you? Are you God? Who is your father? Onye Kibu. Hey? Anyways, I don't have much time to talk to you. But one thing I will always want you to have it at the back of your mind is that. Who is he that said it a thing and it come to pass when the Lord God Almighty has not commanded it? Exactly. Nobody. 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 So you do not have any right to cost us. Um, Vincent, now that you want to leave, make sure you take her with, with you. Because I don't want to stay with her any longer in this village. No. I don't want to have her anywhere close to me or close to my children. Go. She just lost her child. Who cares? Who cares? Like I care. She Who lost cares? what? How can she have children when all everything that is in her is full of curses? Millicent. Millicent! So you cost my family, right? You cost my family. Very well then. Stand up, pack your things. Let's leave. I said pack your things. I'm going to come get inside, back my friend. Can't believe me. Go. I don't have one. Frock all day. Nonsense. Why would you not miscarriage? Tell me 
me why you will not miscarry because of your wicked heart. You are you so desperately wicked. Time to cost me, cost my family. Hey, boy, who are you? Who are you? Millicent, I'm asking you, who are you? Who is your father's self? Leave my house. Nonsense. Take her with you. Someone that does not even have the name. It's coming yeah. to the court Millicent. Millicent! How dare you? How do you place a curse on my family? I'm talking to you, Millicent. You are wicked. Evil. Look at you. Witch! I don't even know what to call you. Coward! I was very bitter. They hurt me. They hurt me so much. Even with my pregnancy, I went to the farm. I cooked. I did all the chores. They never allowed me to go to the hospital. No checkup. No antenatal. Nothing. And because of all that, I lost my child. Our child, Vincent. Our child. Even when I lost my child, they had the guts to accuse me of killing my child. How wicked, how wicked can they be? They didn't even mind that I was pregnant. They made me do all that chores. How can they be that wicked? <sighs> My child. Baby. They killed my child. I'm so sorry. Please. I, I'm so sorry. I didn't know all these things happened. We'll make another baby. I promise. Okay? We'll make another baby. I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry. Please. They killed my it's child. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please go inside. Okay. Come. Come. I'm so Vincent, peak now, peak. Oh. Hello? Why are you disturbing him? Can't you understand when a man doesn't need you anymore? Leave this as the law for me. If I just because of you and go to my village, which is a family, you regret the day you said yes to this.
position, like your husband or any family. Nobody. What is wrong? It's level, level. Very happy. Sorry. 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 Take it easy. Ow! Hey. Oh. Please go there and prepare for the theater. Be fast. Go, go, go. I will take care of her. Yeah, sorry. 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 Take it easy. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. You say your husband is not here? Ha. Huh. with you. From what I saw at the scan, there's no way you can give birth normal. A CS has to be conducted and your husband or any of your relatives needs to be here to sign the document. Doctor, unless you want to take me and my child to the mortuary, just allow me to sign because there is nobody to sign for me. Please, let me sign. Let me sign the form myself. Madam, <laughs> things are not done that way. Anyone in your condition will sign any document given to them. So you have to call someone. Doctor, do you want me to die? Unless you want me to die. Because even if we stay from now till eternity, nobody is coming here to sign for me. Especially my husband. My husband will not come. So let me, let me sign. Why if you want? Ah! If you want to bring the form, bring the form, let me sign it. Let me sign, make a video. Let me at least people will see that I gave my consent. This pain is too much. Okay, no problem. Nurse, take her to the theater. I'll join you guys soon. Get the theater set, Lucy. Careful, careful, careful. to make a list of what um, Ms. Okinwa will be needing while she's recovering. Meanwhile, she will give you her house address. Go to her place, get her baby things and her personal things. I wonder why some men are very useless beyond prayers. Yes, my team. Do you still remember the pain? Yes, sir. Okay, good. Sure. Get the things quickly. Okay? Oh. Yes, come in. Nurse Lucy, so you are still around? Yes, doctor. Good evening. Evening. I thought you might have gone home. Not why we have a patient we both are responsible for. 
Oh, Thank you very much. I could not have gone through this alone without your support. It's 10 days today and the husband remained in age. May God have mercy. Oh yes. Um, I will have to discharge her tomorrow. She will be strong enough to go. But meanwhile, I would have Nurse Oge go with her for a few more days. That yeah. is wonderful. I was just coming out from the award. They were both sleeping. Doctor, mm -hmm. she is so worn out and sad, even in her sleep. You could have me soon then. Doctor, yeah. I just said let me come and see you and know how you're doing. Oh, thank you very much. I'm fine. Okay, I'm going now. All right. Bye. Okay, yes. Thank you. Madam, it's okay. You really don't have to say much. You know you are still here. Just make sure you take care of yourself and your son. And don't forget to bring him back in three days for circumcision. Just take care of yourself and your son. <sighs> Doctor, may God put smiles on your face. Just the way you helped a helpless woman. May you never lack help in every aspect of your life. Meanwhile, I'll make sure Nurse Oge goes with you for a few more days till you fully recover and make sure you can cope. Okay? Thank you. Ah, this one is too much, oh. It's too much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Nothing is too much for our golden baby. Something bad would have befell us that would have taken away my license and my hospital. If not for the destiny of this child that saved us. So we have to treat, treat him with absolute care. <laughs> I'll be in my office till you are ready to go. Just let me know when you are ready to leave, okay? okay. Ah, golden baby. Alright, I'll see you later, ma'am. Just look at yourself, Millicent. Just look at yourself. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Are you not? When will you stop asking me about money? When? You have suddenly become a liability to me and I don't like it. I don't like it any longer. I regret the day I married you. Am I the only person that, got, that has a wife? Am I? If not for this baby, I, 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 I was his Yes. Who are you and who are you looking for? <laughs> huh? a question and you're laughing. Who are you looking for? Ask him. Ask him. I'm asking you again. 
Is that girl pregnant for you? And who told you that? Who told you? Yes, I just answer the question. Is she pregnant for you? Woman, since you have found out with your witchcraft, yes, she is pregnant for me. And she's due very soon. Are you okay now? I hope you're satisfied. Black witch. Nonsense. <laughs> baby, ah, your baby is not grown up. Oh, Leslie. He's looking very <laughs> handsome. Baby, how are you? He's <laughs> good. Yeah. Um, Mamugo, I actually came here to discuss something with you. What is it? See, I'm just thinking, you know, because of the way things are now, mm -hmm. eh? What if we start contributing for 5,000 naira every month in yeah, water? Yeah. At the end of the year, we would have gotten a substantial amount of money. We can even use the money to buy food stuff. Mm. What do you think? Mm -hmm. It's a very good idea. I like it. Hi! In fact, I will tell some of my friends and my customers. Mm -hmm. I know they will like it too. Thank you very much. Thank you. Please, let me quickly rush and go and feed my baby. Okay. Breast milk no longer holds it. <laughs> Breast milk is no longer enough. So let me go and cook. Hey, men and breast, both young and old. I'm you. <laughs> okay, my Thank dear. Thank you very much. Okay. Hey, it's a very good idea. Contributing five five thousand at the end of the year, we use it to buy food stuff. It's a very good idea. In fact, I will, I will like it. I will join, and I will tell some of my friends. Okay. Uh. Let me go to the shop. Millicent! Millicent! Get up, get up! Millicent! So you did it! You finally did it, eh? Did what? What are you talking about? Millicent, how could you? You killed a child. You killed a child just because you hate her. An innocent child. Millicent, how cruel and wicked can you be? How? Hmm? When will this your wickedness stop, Millicent? When? Must you kill anyone that crosses your path? First, it was my sister, Bere. She died during her delivery. As if that wasn't good enough for you. Onina was sent out of her marriage because of series of miscarriages. Now, Enno lost our child. Millicent, you're wicked! Your mother killed your sister. Your mother allowed Onyinye to be sent out of her marriage because of her. I lost my child because of your mother. Her marriage is not working. So, if there's anybody to be blamed in this situation, it is your mother. Oh, so I know is her name. <laughs> And no, really. Anyway, I do not have a hand in anything that is happening to her. She's simply paying for putting Asunder in her marriage. Is that so? Is that it, eh? Millicent, I regret the day I got married to you. You black witch. Millicent, Millicent! The war just started. Watch and see. Black witch. Started this business. Eh? Ah, ah. In three months, I have saved 300,000. More. Hey! 
Mm, Chineka, he's a real. I think I should just open another account and then remove the contribution money. Eh, but that will be after my next cotton trip before. My love, come. Come, 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 Asina. Come, baby, come, come, come. Sit. What did he say? I've served your lunch. You made lunch? Yes. Wow. You know, your food is always sweet. Just as sweet as you. Hmm? So, jump into the dining. Vincent. <laughs> 